days never pass. It earlier. Well, needless to say, we've had some issues. So, uh, you know, back here again. That's what that's saying. I wouldn't have got all of them. Maybe I would have got three. One of them would have been a guess. This is where our fight begins. We'll never get back what we lost, but I've made up my mind. No matter what it takes, the black mobile suit will pay. G System 1. Four. Kill the bear, but I'm thinking I'm gonna be a robot. This is a mobile suit? Wow, that's cool! Yeah, the G-System's really something. I had no idea you could make such huge things with it. I literally just noticed... Does this mean we're really... But ...going after them? I think... Of Chris course! Has... That's why we made this. I knew it! I'm with you. Target. Did you feel that? Behind you! I'm starting to wonder how good a friend is. A mobile suit? How the heck did it get in here? Okay. Who cares? What are we gonna do? 
What are we gonna do? We're gonna fight, that's what. No way! We gotta get out of here! Now! Take it easy, Fritz. But... But nothing. We've got to get through this! Hold on there, bad boy. <laughs> I don't know how to pilot this thing. Come on, give me a hand. Me? How? The manual Marie gave us. Pick that Remember? Flip off through it. Come on. Right. Oh, yeah. Thanks, Fritz. I mean, as long as you're not wearing a shirt that says shoot me for, for, for a free chicken bucket. You know? <laughs> I don't think you can get enough for it. Left analog stick, the further you push the left analog stick, the faster the mobile suit will be. Left analog stick, I'll try it out. Hopefully, the mic's going to be a little bit better. Not so hot. I got a rather far distance to explore. Hey, bro. Think you got your ride? Don't mind the pink slip. It's a little red, but that's fine. Phew. Did I beat him? Who was that guy anyway? I wonder if he was one of them. Woohoo! You did it. Are you hurt? No, just a bit shaky. That was awesome. You won your first fight. Yeah, well, this mobile suit had a lot to do with that. Yeah, but so did you. You're the man. Ha, listen to you. Just a minute ago, you're about to wet your pants. Yeah, well, uh, anyway. I guess the question is, what do we do now? Excuse me. Hmm, we better talk with Marie. Marie, the fossil? Oh man, do we have to? If all you do is complain, I might as well leave you here. Alright, alright, I'm coming. Hold on a second though, there's something I want to do first.
Now, uh, it might take me a minute to do the equip stuff, and it kind of takes the save menu a second, so I might just go ahead and kind of do all that, and then cut it all out for you guys. Oh. Like there's some smalls in these tunnels, but they're just little tiny things. I mean, they're outside too. Are you sure you want to do this? You know I don't want to fight. Still, I'm going to make them pay for what they did to Miss Natalie and the other kids. Great. Alright, we'll do this together. We have a long fight ahead of us. But as long as we stick together, there's nothing we can't do. Head north. That's the way to Marie's place. Marie's place? Oh. Do I have to tell you to stop calling me that? Seriously, over this day, overestimate my age, young man. Okay. Makeup can work miracles, they say. Why don't you show us your real face if you're so young? Tiss, tiss, tiss. You know what curiosity did to this cat? <laughs> you're old and you know it. Stop fooling yourself. You're not half as old as you think. Don't make me repeat myself.
Battle Many lights. Do you know what they are? Mm. Mobile suits? Exactly. Each light represents a single suit. But, but there's so many of them. That's the power of the G system. Even you were able to harness it. But this production speed. It's off the charts. I don't like the looks of this. Not one bit. Like, like I said, I did try to play this earlier, and I just had so many problems. You ready, Fritz? Let's go to Angelia. Hey, hold on. Before we go to Angelia, I'd like to see the orphanage just one more time. I thought you said you couldn't bear to see it. I know, but now I need it. So I won't forget why we're doing it. Let's see what you mean. Okay, so the orphanage is in. Off we go. I did have Fritz running around. Main mobile too. So here we are. It's just like when it was when we left it. Hard to believe it's been a year already. Being here really brings back memories. I'm warning you now. There's like a bright white flash at the end of this. Dark mode users beware. Yep, right there. Ow, sorry. And it's gonna do it again, too. 
Now don't forget, there's nothing you can't do if you set your mind to it. Thanks for everything, Miss Natalie. I'll remember that. I'm sure you will. Just promise me one thing. I promise you'll stay out of fight. Don't worry, I'm 15. I'm not a kid anymore. I know, but I'm still worried about you. You're a good boy, but you can be so stubborn sometimes. I won't get into any fight, I promise. I'm holding you to that night. Well, guess I better be going. Miss Natalie, I'm going to work hard. You see, I'll go, I'm going to make you proud. I already am. shock. I mean, I know that's the easy choice, but... No! No! I mean, honestly, that's about all I remember. No. Miss Natalie. Of course, it's all That char? Is that a Pikachu? <laughs> Let's make a promise right now. Make the people who did this pay. You bet. I promise. We're the only ones left now. That's us. Uh, right. We can't let them get away with this. Come on. Angelia can't be far from here. Miss Natalie. No, I promise not to fight. And I'm sorry for breaking my promise. This fight isn't for me. It's to avenge you and the others. It's a fight to rid the world of all this pain and suffering. I won't ask you to forgive me, but I hope you understand. Isn't that why most people say they fight? Because they want to end the pain and suffering. As long as you promise not to harm the villagers. Uh, what's up with this guy? He seems to think we're raiding the village or something. Yeah, it looks like it. Better tell him about Miss Fossil. Hey, fuck that, you better be nice to her. Good idea. My name is Titan. You know her. Please tell Constable Ox of the Unicorns that Marie sent us. I'm Constable Ox, and I wouldn't have told anything about this. I'm your really friends of Marie. You bet. A letter from her. We need your help. Please let us inside the building. A letter from Marie, eh? Hey? Very well. I'll grant you access. However, you have to leave your mobile suits outside the village. No problem. I'll be waiting for you at the Unicorn Base. Bring the letter with you.
card to the unicorns. Look for the building with the unicorn on it. Got it. Sorry for scaring everyone at the moment. Policy accepted. Now let's see this letter of Marie. It's over Marie for protection. to be even worse than a great fall. We could really use your help. I understand what you're asking, but tell me this. Why are two youngsters like you so hell-bent on fighting? We're the only survivors of Miss Natalie's orphanage. We're looking for the mobile suit and the attack flight. I see. Very well. We'll do what we can to help you. Thanks, Constable. You know, some mobile suits have been spotted in the ruins in the southeast. I don't know if they're the ones you're looking for, but you may want to check it out. The ruins in the southeast? Are they from before the Great Fall? No, it's actually a spaceship that came down after the Great Fall. We call it the Moon Ark. This is the only lead we've got. I say we check it out. The unicorns were founded shortly after the Great Fall, 60 years ago. They provide and maintain safe use of various key systems. Unicorns have been key players in rebuilding our world from its past. Professor Poole, who lives in the mansion up the hill, knows more about them. You should ask him for more information. They wouldn't bother with a little country village like this one, would they? Did you hear about the robot? I wonder if they'll attack this village too. Hey, you know what? All the food in Nankelia is actually grown in the field. Isn't that crazy? I mean, a key system would give you the same food at the push of a button. Like, yeah, where is it coming from? Like, just energy. Like, that's a lot of energy. Like, that's a lot, a lot of energy. Welcome to our item shop. Stock up for the journey ahead. Let me tell you something. Southeast of here lies the moon arc. It's a ship that fell from the sky. I saw it fall when I was young. It gave me a real fright, it did.
Puppy. in the video, but I mean, y'all can just about read what that, what that, I mean, if y'all don't, if y'all know what that is, you know what that is, and I know what that is, I mean, I'm just saying, what are mobile suits? Mobile suits are humanoid weapons in common use during the age known as the universal century. Much of the data about them were lost in the Great Fall, but a portion survived although mysteries abound. Detailed records have recently been unearthed in the islands known as Japan. It is likely the discovery will lead to major advances in our ongoing studies of mobile suits. Like, is this supposed to be a secret packet passage? Because it's not very secret, and it's not supposed to be a secret passage. Ooh, why is it buggered up like that? Because that's pretty buggered. Like, dude, they're like kids in Roblox that would make fun of you. I mean, they make fun of me too, but it's like, I'm making fun of you, so I know they'd be making fun of you. Mystery of the Lost Era. The age known as the Universal Century is now referred to as the Lost Era. Though archaeological research has unearthed overwhelming evidence that the Universal Century was fact and not fiction. Many researchers continue to assert that it never really happened. Universal Century researchers are divided into two camps, the believers and the non-believers. Their fierce debate continues to this day. Scars of the Great Fall Humanity lost practically everything to the Great Fall. 90% of the world population lost their lives, and civilization, history, and art science were all but wiped out. We sacrificed within the span of just a single week what it had taken our forefathers thousands of years to create. G-System Studies The G-System was a technological breakthrough developed by Rivid Zarth, head of the Zarth Corporation. The G-System uses condensed energy units called ECAPs as catalysts create almost any object out of common everyday materials such as dirt or water. Yeah, but, but where's the dirt and water? Like, like how do y'all not run out of dirt and water? <laughs> like, there's a lot of it, but it's still finite. <laughs> Yeah. 
you have that. I want that. Mm. I want the fish. I want the water. I want to eat the fish and drink the water. Mm. Can't eat and drink Zaku. <laughs> I mean, you can. It doesn't taste very good. <laughs> Crawling with monsters. Hey, I'm getting an energy reading. Come on, Fritz, we're going in. <laughs> 